What's up and welcome back. I'm Steph Sabra, joined again with Sintel. What's cracking, baby? We are continuing on our journey of Ekta Tiger Part 2 reaction. You will be seeing a cut down version of our reaction on YouTube because we're only allowed to show you a certain amount of picture in picture. But if you want to watch the whole movie with us, no cuts, no interruptions, then you can do that one of two ways. Either become a patron at patreon.com slash or a member on this YouTube channel. Right here, you'll just need your own version of the movie or your own copy of it and then you'll just throw it up in a side-by-side -side screen with us and then we'll all be hanging out we're gonna be watching it on amazon prime and if you're already a member or a member or patron thank you so much we really appreciate you if um, since you are on youtube make sure you hit the subscribe button bell icon all notifications and vote this up so youtube knows that you liked hanging out with us today and we're gonna get right back into it <laughs> Like stop the car in the middle of the road. <laughs> I need to see it now. There she goes. Wait, what? Oh, never seen that before. Yo, he put the plug in his leg. Stabbed him in the neck with a plug. <laughs> Right? Can I please have the pleasure of this dance? I'm sorry, it's not correct for me to. It's a lot tiger jacket. The egg peace conference. Eh? Alright, that was a little slick. Tunia Kisari diplomats egg those with the sun Bus Hindustani or Pakistani egg. Upne up nekone mekhane. Okay. I'm not taking care of these ones. <laughs> she like, what are you, high? <laughs> Tiger. Jaldi karo airport jana hai. Zoya, baby. Baby, ab kahan pe hai? Dekhe, humara airport jane ka wakt ho gaya hai. Ooh, a boat chase scene, hopefully? Oh, yeah. Let's do that. On the run. Khabar mili hai ki ek Pakistani delegate bhi missing hai subha se. हमें आपकी फिक्र है बीबी वो बहुत ही खतरनाक एजेंट है मैं ठीक हूँ लेकिन आप लोगों को थोड़ा सब्र करना पड़ेगा इतना आसान नहीं है उसको बेवकूफ बनाना लेकिन हमारी फ्लाइट में तो एक घंटा बाकी हम कजाकिस्तान नहीं जा रहे फिर कहा जा रहे देखते हैं जल्दी चलो उसकी <laughs> Y'all ran up on the wrong ones. Yeah, sorry. Oh, my baby. 
caused a little bit of a scene. Sarit, why did you send me to me? Don't send me to my correspondents. Don't send me to my mind. I'm getting tired of watching things. I'm going to sit here and sit here. Havana, sir. Why? Why are you doing this? Damn. कह रहे हैं इतनी बड़ी अमाउंट के लिए मैनेजर का ऑथराइजेशन चाहिए। वो अभी यहाँ है नहीं। अभी उस अमाउंट का सिर्फ आधा दे सकते हैं। चलो फिलहाल उतने तो ले आ। मैं इन पैसों से गाड़ी लेके आता हूँ। तुम बैंक से पूरे पैसे फिर ड्रॉप कर लेना। ए पुलिसिया पर फावर। बस बीबी। बहुत भागी। � Deep. No! Mm. By way of bus. Ooh. क्यों ऐसी क्या चीज़ है जो उनके पास से जो हमारे पास नहीं है? I'll call you back. Gopi, तुझे पता है ना कि जोया हमें कितना इनफॉरमेशन दे सकती है? अंदाज़ा है ना तुझे? जोया हमारे साथ हिंदुस्तान चलने के लिए तैयार है। तो कहाँ है वो? बोला ना उसे। चले। लेकिन जिनके साथ इस वक्त वो है वो से इतिहासानी से हिंदुस्तान आने नहीं देंगे। तू चाहता है कि हम क्यूबा में आईएसआई को अटैक करें। एक मुझे पकड़ने के लिए पूरी फौज लेकर आया है। सर पकड़ने भी तो उस आदमी को आए हैं जिस आदमी से सब कुछ सीखा है। वाह एक आखिरी बार। सर। He just took over the whole mission। भाग गया ना आपको अकेला छोड़कर। Yikes! Dad is coming. My man. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay, I dig it. Sorry, my eye. Yeah. Quick. <laughs> poor, poor dude, just going on to work. <laughs> yeah, karate chopped in the neck and his bike took. Sorry, my guy. <laughs> and I actually can't give this back. Y'all gotta get to going. Uh, 
Uh oh. Here's where we get real crazy with it. Is he gonna like land the plane, the bike in the plane? He's got the got Pakistan and India working together. See, love brings us all together. Yeah. You see? He even got sworn enemies fighting together to get him. That's love, baby. That's love. from Gobi too, wasn't it? Oh, no. Yep. Last chance, homie. <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, look at him. Get your ass in the plane, baby. <laughs> I'ma get you, baby! <laughs> now y'all need to keep a low profile. Maybe go to a place where there's low cri street crime. Hey, we just used Hello? a million, billion Hello? dollars in funds to Should not get the guy. <laughs> Hey, boss. Give Tiger. me my two weeks. <laughs> my two weeks notice. Oh, Sir, the first time you called me from my real name. Ah. Sir, just in India and Pakistan, there will be no need for ISI. That day, we will come back. Good luck. Oh, okay. He took that in stride. Agent Tiger and Agent Zoya are raw and ISI ki files. Mein गुमशुदा करार कर दिया गया है लेकिन अब भी दुनिया के अलग अलग शहरों में उनके देखे जाने की खबर मिलती रहती है टाइगर और जोया दुनिया के जिस भी कोने में होंगे शायद ये खबर सुनकर मुस्करा रहे होंगे <laughs> is that it? I guess yeah, it's a roll, huh? This, yeah. yeah. Okay. So love does bring us together. I guess yes. is the overall. It's in time. What are your thoughts post movie watch? I can't lie. I really enjoyed the back half of the movie. I like the the action sequences were really spot on. It started off really good, got off the gates really, really well, because there were some amazing action sequences with that. And the second half of the movie, we got a chance to revisit some of those uh action action sequences again so overall I, I just really like i could see why this could be a series especially if the series is going to revolve around like trying to track them down that would be fun to watch yeah totally i like the the pacing was a little off to me and some of like the cuts were a little off but okay. i do like the idea that you think it's about a mission but it's really a romance i think that's fun and like in unique and i wasn't expecting it to be like the whole thing was like that and mm. i enjoyed that aspect of it that they really were just like going with their heart instinct and like being like all right i'll risk it all for you like that's okay like i love that bonnie and clyde type love like and I love that quote they used in Cuba, in Cuba where it says, like, if it's not saying love, it's not love. Like, yeah, I don't know if that's that the best good. advice, but I love that. <laughs> you know, the crazy in me is like, yes, like, be psychotic for each other, like, lose it all for each other. But I thought their chemistry was fantastic. I really enjoy both of those actors. I've seen them before. Okay. And I thought their chemistry was, like, really, really, like, sparking. Yeah, and I love the scenery. Like, you pointed out a few times the different locations that they shot at i thought was really really well done it was like a paid vacation to do this fun job as an actor i think the other thing that kind of like really stood out to me is yo i don't know who the stunt lady is that was doubling for zoya but that lady needs a raise because she's totally was killing it. Totally, like like <laughs> some of the most, some of the best stunts came from that stunt lady. Um, so yeah, that, that's big, big kudos to to that. That's not an easy thing to do and to pull off because you know sometimes like, I can't lie, I do look to try to see the stunt person's face to see if it matches, 
And, and it didn't always match with Tiger Stunt Man, but it did match really well with Zoya. There was a, some really good, some really good moments that they. Yeah, I agree. I think that like sometimes with women stunt doubles, you will have like sometimes they put a man to stunt do or do their stunts, and it's like mm. so obvious because the physique is different. Mm. And this one, I couldn't tell. I do look for the faces too, but I, I felt <laughs> like I could see more of like some of the green screen. This came out in 2012, 11 years ago. So. Yeah, Ten years, yeah, eleven, yeah, eleven years. So ago. that looked yeah. good, yeah. But um, definitely, there were some green screen parts where I'm like, "Wow, we have come a long way in green screen." And that <laughs> looked good even then. So I thought her stunt work was really fun. They do a really good job. I've had been privileged enough to watch some projects with you before when they've gone international with it as well. And uh, one of the things I always find fun, it's not a good Indian film to me, an Indian project, unless the music is right. And they did a really good job of blending the different cultures with uh, with an Indian tone to go like like the music when they were like in Istanbul was a little, lot different than it, definitely different than it was when they were in Cuba. In Cuba. For sure. Uh, and so they they still maintain the essence of the culture where the cinema is, is based in, but, you know, did some really good hat tips to the countries that they were visiting, I thought. I thought that was a nice mix. Yeah, I thought that when we touched down in different locations, they did a really good job with shot selection and music selection of setting the tone of a different location. Mm -hmm. The like, spy music sometimes wasn't my favorite. Like when they were mm -hmm. in their action sequences, I'm like, it's a little slapsticky, I guess. I don't know what the word <laughs> is, but a little like, this is spy music, you know, <laughs> like <laughs> not as smooth as the other music was. Right. But I also, talking about music, I liked the, I think we only got like two musical breaks, but I, yeah. I enjoyed both of those sequences. Yeah, but I agree with you on your first point that I do think that it's a fun series. It's kind of like a twist on Mr. and Mrs. Smith. I wonder if they'll do more crime stopping together or they're like, we'll just constantly be on the run. I feel like it will be cool to see how the story evolves. Love is crazy. Yes. Ain't so, that right? You know, when, you, when you're all in. Yeah, you know, my man was like, I'm going to get my girl. Right. I loved how I love how they played each agency against each other. That was a nice, nice little piece too. I really I liked the first half Gobi better than the second half Gobi. Second half of Gobi was his best tigers, I guess his second man hand mm -hmm. second hand man part of me was hoping that Gobi would be like I get it dog you know I'm gonna try and maybe help you maybe turn my back to the agency and just pretend like I didn't see it but nah Gobi all the way to the end was like nah dog you ain't getting away from me <laughs> like, I'm not getting killed because you fell in love <laughs> yeah, exactly he's like this is all on what? you man <laughs> yeah he's like I love you but not that much exactly he was like listen you found your heart and your love and I'm happy for you but I'm not getting fired for right. you right <laughs> right uh, lastly, I love the touch on the conflict of India and Pakistan. I thought that last line was really deep and well done where they he was like, I wasn't introduced to her as an enemy. And then I fell in love with her. And now I'm confused how she is the enemy. Truly, love does solve everything. And I know it's like easier said than done. But it is so interesting as humans, we create these borders and conflicts in our mind of people when we're all just people. <laughs> Mm. It's like we all breathe the same air, bleed the same. Yeah, we all want to be loved and understood. So, yeah. Yeah. So that was fun, fun watch. Thanks y'all so much for hanging out with us. Before you go, make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon, all notifications, and give a thumbs up so YouTube knows that you liked hanging out with us today. Um, Sintel, thank you so much for joining me on this watch. <laughs> oh, love you. oh my gosh, it's always a joy. Thank you. <laughs> and I'm Steph Sabra. We'll see you later. Much love. Peace.